quit. I'm a quick clowning. Uh, yeah. How y'all doing? It's your girl. Okay, so I've been away for a minute. Um, please excuse my lateness with this video. This is an install, and this is a two-week review of this hair. And um, shout out to my before I even get started. Thank you to my new subscribers. Shout out to the, all the old subscribers for joining my channel. Um, so yeah, let's get into this video. I got this hair installed on September 7th. Okay. And today's date, by the way, is... What is today? Today is the 22nd of September. So I've had this hair in since... The 7th of September, this is the Peruvian Curly Wave um, from AliExpress. I bought this with my own money. Um, this is not a paid review. Like I said, I bought this, you know, hair with my own money. And I got four bundles. I got an 18, 20, a 22, and a 24. Um, I'm six foot tall, so if you guys can see, and I apologize if I'm not in the frame, but... It comes to my waist, pretty much. Um, I got this from AliExpress. The name of the vendor is called Sexy Hair Products. I'll put all the, the information below. Again, if I'm not in the frame, I apologize because I don't even know if I'm even in the frame, but whatever. So, so yeah. Um, you can see right here, this is the 18 inch, my hair, all my hair, all this is mine, that's out, all this at the top is out, um, this is a full sew-in, I decided not to do a closure with this hair, I just wanted to leave some of my hair out, um, but as you can see, the curl pattern, um, I did not... What did I do? I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything to this hair. I didn't dye this hair. I didn't perm it. I didn't do anything. All I did was wash it. I did a co-wash with the, um, actually, no, I didn't use that yet. Let me show you guys what I used. Okay. I was watching my girl, Renee 304, and she recommended, um, these two products right here for curly and wavy hair. Let me just say, these shampoo, this shampoo and conditioner is really, really good. I, I purchased this from Ulta. These were $20 um, a piece. And this is the conditioner. And it's by Alba Moisture Conditioner. And you can look this up online. It's also on Ulta's website. I also got the AG Recoil Curl Activating Shampoo. And so I co-wash with this right here. I also got some um, Herbal Essence Hello Hydration Shampoo and Conditioner. I got that as well. Um, I also purchased a really big thing of the silicone mix from eBay. This was, it was under $20 with free shipping. And this is the 36 ounce. So I got that. I also picked up the Frizzies John Frieda Dream Curls. That's important to have for this type of hair. I also picked up the Garnier Fructis um, Anti-Freeze Serum Slick and, what is this? Slick and Shine. This is really good. I like the way it smells. And I also picked up the Three Sisters of Nature Natural Curling Jello. Um, Renee was also recommending to use this um, for this type of hair. So I got that. You're also going to need some Carefree Curl Instant Activator. This is really good. And you need some type of mousse um, that you use your diffuser with because you definitely want to also get a diffuser with this type of hair. So I got this because I have ran out. I'm getting low on my Herbal Essence Curl Boosting Mousse. This is really, really good as well as this one. So you basically, when you get ready to wash your hair and all that good stuff, I got so many hair products. Um, 
when you, you know, get through co-washing or washing your hair, whatever you're doing, you want to put some of that mousse on your hair while your hair is wet. You also want to put some of this on it while it's wet. And you get your diffuser on your blow dryer. And you just section the hair off like that. Right now, I have a little bit of product in the hair. When the hair dries up, this is basically what it's going to look like. Just like this. And um, I love it. Um, does it tangle a little bit in the back, which normally in your nape area, that's normal. I've had tangling in the back, but no tangling in the front around the sides or anything like that. Um, does the hair shed? Yeah, it, it does shed, but not, you know, nothing crazy. However, I did seal my West with the Freycheck. You can get that from Michael's Craft Store, Joanne. You can get it from Walmart. I don't know if Target sells it, but yeah. Um, I also put a little bit of this leave-in conditioner in it. That's really, really good. And then for my to do my edges, I use... I think it's in my bag. Oh, yeah, it's in here. I use a, I found a different product, a new product that I've actually been um, eyeing in Sally's, but this is the Control Edge Glaze in the Coconut Shea. And it's by this company right here. I think this was $7.99 or $10, one of them, but if you have your discount card, so yeah. But that's what I use for my leave out. And it's not, you know, it's still soft. It's not, you know, nothing crazy. But, um, so yeah. And this, let me see, I think it's this one. This conditioner is a minty um, scent. It smells like the tree, 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 tea tree shampoo. And this one just smells like a, doesn't have a mint smell to it, but it still smells good. So yeah. Loving the hair. Um, what I purchased from this, this is my first time purchasing from this vendor, ladies. Um, what I purchased from them again, yeah. Um, the reviews, there weren't, there weren't no reviews on this particular vendor or this hair. And I basically took a chance. You're taking a chance when you order hair anyway because you don't know what you're going to get. But I will say, again, this is my, you know, my own opinion. I pay for the hair with my own money. Um, if it's not good, I'm not going to recommend it to nobody. At the end of the day, when you make a purchase on AliExpress, you know, you got to understand you pay for what you get. Um, so far, I haven't had any problems with, you know, with this hair. Um, like I said, I'm very satisfied. And let me explain to you guys what happened with the last hair. Let me go get the other hair and I'll show you. Okay, so when I did my install on my last um, weave that I had, my hair was red. I had the Peruvian Body Wave from New Star Hair Team. Well, the hair was is good hair. What I purchased from them again, yes. But what I did, this is, <laughs> I'm embarrassed to kind of show y'all. This is that hair. And it's messed up, as you can see. This is a big old knot right here, if you guys can see that. I mean, it's when I say knotted up, I couldn't get this out for the life of me. What happened with this hair, I basically damaged this hair myself. Um, like I said, the hair was fabulous. I didn't have any type of issues and stuff with it until I did what I did to this hair. I had dyed the hair twice. I had did, the first time I dyed it, I did a 40 volume Clairol bleach, you know, lift on the hair. Then I dyed cellophane on top of the hair. Color took beautiful, but when I went to wash my hair and when I got in the shower, it, the color, the cellophane just got everywhere. It looked like Jason in the bathroom. So I was like, okay, that's not going to work because it was getting on my clothes as well. So what happened was I went to Sally's and I purchased some permanent red, um, and another, I explained to her, you know, what I did with the hair. She's like, oh, yeah, you know, you could dye it, da-da-da-da-da. 
Well, when I dyed it the second time, it was like I killed the hair. And then it, that's when I started having the problems. So I used the 30 volume like she told me to do. And also the highlights by L'Oreal or uh, Claire. I think it's by L'Oreal. Um, in the box, it's like orange and black and stuff. And I did one box of a magenta and two boxes of a red hot. That's how I achieved this color, that the which was the final color, because I let the cellophane, I kept washing the hair before I dyed it to really get a lot of that cellophane out. So then when I put the second dye job, this is what I came up with. Baby, it, it was like the hair, it wouldn't hold a curl. After I did that, it wasn't holding a curl. It wasn't, um, it was madding up, you know, it was starting to shed. And when I, you know, so then, I have bought this shampoo, the second shampoo and conditioner. The first time I had cold washed the hair and stuff, I had used this brand, no problem. Well, when the hair started tripping, I was like, okay, this is a, a repair. You know, I had seen, you know, good reviews on this product right here by L'Oreal. So I went and got it and I let the conditioner set you know, on the hair. I put the penetrating oil by organics on here and everything. And this hair, when I had washed it with that shampoo, before I went to bed, I was letting the hair, I was letting the hair air dry. Well, I was up talking to my sister because I was at my sister's house. And then it was like, as it was air drying, I said, okay, I'm gonna put two braids. So I braided the hair up like this. And I just, you know, I did, a braid right here and then a braid right here when I woke up the next morning I slept on this side when I woke up the next morning this side came down with no problem I had unbraided it came down no problem this side when I started unbraiding it from the bottom when I got right here that's when all this it was like it was sitting up like that on my head baby let's be crystal clear I tried everything to get the knots out of this hair. Like, you can't even break it. Look. I mean, it's, when I say it's, it's, it ain't departing like the Red Sea, it ain't doing nothing. I was so devastated. I was like, I just lost my investment. So, this is a lesson. A good lesson right here. Diet, you know, I feel like any extensions that you buy, you know, it's an investment. You want to take care of your investment. I learned from this right here. So, again, New Star Hair Team hair is good hair, but after what I did to it, it just, you know, and some may argue and say, well, even with you dying it the second time, the hair shouldn't do that. That could be true. I'm new to the game. Well, I'm not new to the game because I've been wearing extensions for a while, but this type of hair I'm new to. I've never worn, I've always worn the Beauty Supply Store hair and, you know, and Remy hair. So, when I started getting into this, you know, I thought I did my research, but apparently, I don't know, but, you know, and then when I got this hair, I wanted to dye it, but because what happened with this, I was so scared, and I was like, no, I'm not going to dye the hair. I'm not going to do nothing to it. I'm going to just leave it alone. So I am going to purchase some more Body Wave. I'm probably going to get Brazilian, because I haven't tried Brazilian hair, so yeah. Uh, this what happened to my hair. <laughs> Look at that. That shit. I mean, it's... When I say it's matted, look at that. Baby, I, I, a, a bitch was sick. I was sick. Yes, I was sick. I was sick. $271 down the drain. I lost the closure. I lost all four bundles, the closure, everything. So, but so far, this hair is good. I haven't, you know, like I said, there's no dye. This is the natural color that it came in. And luckily, because my natural hair color is not... Um, thank you. It's not, um, my roommate. <laughs> it's my natural hair color is like more of a sandy brown colorish, like not really black, but it's not really like brown brown. It's kind of like in between somewhere. So yeah, this is pretty much it. So, and how I wear this at night, I usually put it up like that. And I'll put one of them big rubber bands around. Or I'll put it up. I'll do two braids like, you know, with the other hair. And that usually works or whatever. 
sometimes I'll sleep in it just, you know, like this or whatever. But yeah, I love it. Giving me all kind of Diana Ross, Donna Summerish. This is my, some of my hair I left out in the back in case I'm going to put my hair up in a ponytail and all that. But yeah, so I don't know if I'm going to get the other hair from AliExpress or if I'm going to go with somebody that I follow off of Instagram that sells hair. So we'll just see. I'm, I'm going to see what kind of deals is out there. But so far, I love this hair. Um, nothing major, you know, negative that I can say like, oh, I would never buy this hair again. Because you do have to, especially shopping on AliExpress, ladies, you do have to try vendors. You don't know. Just like, um, I think I'm going to order from... Queen's hair products on AliExpress because I've been hearing good things, but still, you can get a bad batch of hair, your first purchase or your fifth purchase or tenth purchase, and it's just basically bottom line, it's all about consistency with these vendors at the end of the day. So that's pretty much what I can tell you because it, it look it can look good all day long on the internet and the pictures and stuff, but once you get it and start messing with it and doing stuff to it, that's gonna be the real test. So yeah, again, this is the Peruvian. This is the Peruvian um, curly wave hair from AliExpress. I'll leave all the information below. And yeah, um, that's pretty much it. That hair, the red hair, I I think I had that hair in for only a month. I didn't even get the second month out of it. So by the time my month was up, that's when all that crap happened with the hair. But yeah. That's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions, just drop it below. And I'm out. Deuces.